Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on factorising the difference of two squares after taking a common factor out. Now always with more complicated expressions that we want to factorise, always check first whether we have a common factor. So always check if there's a common factor. And once you've factorised out the common factor, there may be other techniques of factorisation that we can use. So let's see if that's going to happen. With this one, let's check if there's a common factor. 8x squared and minus 18. Well, 8 and 18 have a common factor of 2. So we're going to factorise a 2 out. 2 times what is 8x squared? Well, it's 4x squared. 2 times what is minus 18? Well, it's minus 9. Now, can we use any other methods of factorisation here? Well, can you see that this here is the difference of two squares? Because it's a difference of two squared things. 4x squared is something squared. 9 is something squared. It's a square number. So remember how we factorise the difference of two squares. We have two brackets, one plus in the middle, one minus in the middle. And then we do the square root of each of the things. So we do the square root of the first thing here and make it the first thing in these brackets. The square root of 4x squared, well, the square root of 4 is 2. The square root of x squared is x, so it's 2x, because 2x times 2x is 4x squared. And what's the square root of 9? Well, it's 3, so we put the 3 there. And that is the final full factorisation. What about this one? Well, again, we always check if there's a common factor. These have a common factor of x, which we can factorise out. Then x times what is x? Well, it's 1. x times 1 is x. x times what is minus 9x cubed? It's minus 9x squared. And again, we check in this bracket, could we factorise this further? Well, yes, we can. It's a difference of two squares again. So we have two brackets, 1 plus, 1 minus. We do the square root of the first thing, which is 1. So we put the 1 as the first thing. Don't get the order the wrong way around. And what's the square root of 9x squared? Well, 3x times 3x is 9x squared. So you put the 3x there. And that is the final answer.